All right, in this lesson, let's learn the difference between a scan and a seek, because the knowledge of the difference between the two is really fundamental to understanding most of performance tuning. So we've got a lot of good information in our pick here. So the first thing I want to point out is the difference between the scan and the seek. So it doesn't matter what kind of scan we're talking about, table scan or an index scan. The word scan means we are reading all the rows of the index or the table. This is often the least efficient mechanism for reading data. In the first pick, we can see we have a clustered index scan and both are operators on the right-hand side. Scanning means SQL Server has to read every row in the index or table to find what it's looking for. On the next pick, we can see SQL Server was able to find what it was looking for in a very efficient manner. Here's the term seek. A seek does not scan the entire structure, but is able to efficiently retrieve the rows it needs from an index. Also take note of the operators, or operator. We see three different clustered index seeks on our execution plan. On the first plan, you can see the join operator is a hash match, and on the plan with the seek, you can see it's a nested loop. We'll talk more about these later. However, I just wanted to point them out now. Both of these operators have to do with the way the tables are joined and the amount of data that are flowing through each. In the upcoming lessons, we're going to go through scans and seeks in great detail. In this lesson, I just wanted you to become familiar with the concept of a scan versus a seek and its importance.